Yeah, we gon' boss talk 101. Yeah, we gon' talk, we gon' have fun. Woo. We be on fire, we be lit lit. lit. It's a unique hustle, big, big shit. Big shit, big shit, big shit. Huh. It's a unique hustle, nigga, big shit. Big shit, big shit, big shit. Huh. Name another podcast like this. Who gon' bring Check it, check it, check it, check it. It's your boy ECO. <laughs> no money, Moses, by the way. We create content every damn day. Yay, say, man, we in Waco, Texas, man. Hey, man, I'm down here, man, and just, just. Tapped into this city, man, with a, hey, man, I'm here with the mayor, man. I'm here with a guy, man, who don't really need no introduction, man. When I pick up the phone and call and I can't get nobody else up in the Waco area, I know this cat right here gonna, ain't going to let me down. When I'm trying to figure out what's going down in this town, man, I call the mayor, man, my boy Gio. Gio, man. Hey, man. Giovanni, the God, Giovanni, the Great. Giovanni the goat. Hey, like Giovanni the king. Whenever y'all had that clip of you saying that, it was crazy because like the whole city. I, I, what, the way I posted, like I, I, you know, what I'm saying I had people, hard, I, I, put under, I put like the underscore so people could be like, what would he say? But I, I feel like that's how everybody in Waco feel like they know about Waco, but they don't. Even even the big artists like Hot Boy West. You know what I'm saying? You know. But you still don't know. That's that's just how people feel. Cause I guess Waco been so counted out. So when I posted, that shit went crazy. You know so, what I'm saying? So you, you they were just so happy, like, whoa, bro, bro. They like, bro, made it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, but did you say I pulled you in that thing? Nah, that's live. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> nah, for sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Your boy gonna make sure. You hey, know, hey, I be watching too. You hey, know what I'm saying? I don't want to do it like that too. I, I be watching. Man, I will pull him in there, bro. Mm -hmm. I, I put be, him in nah, there. I be watching. You know what I'm saying? That's and, good promotion. And people, people yeah. be, people be. Tagging me It's like I don't even really see it like that But then people tag me And that's they're going crazy it. over it And you know what I'm saying And it's like okay That's crazy You know what, what I'm saying What did you think about the Hot Boy uh interview When I did that thing The the, the, the 100k one I ain't gonna lie Look I'm gonna I'm 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 be real with you I said What the hell I said Why oh, man. Did, you I said, huh? did you get any of that money Huh Did you get any of that money Yeah you probably did the interview blue? Uh, what would you would you say? He did probably you did a money? video or something. From? Did I get any of that money? Yeah, that he blew. Oh, uh, I, I I I know. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I do work with. Uh, shout out to Gucci. Said ten seventeen. Hey, you know what hey I'm everybody got the necklace. You know what I'm saying? It's under there. You know what I'm saying? But shout out to him. Uh, he got his own money. I don't need none of his. That's money. right. You know what I'm everybody, together, every man for himself, right? Man. But um, yeah. You know what I'm saying? He he get the money. But so look, when I seen that, I I, I was shooting a video. And I was telling, I was talking to my homie Jason Anderson. I was shooting a video with him and Waco Tron. We was on the block. And I'm showing him the interview. Wes pulls up. Why my phone <laughs> is on him? And I'm like, man. And he just pulled up and he just chilled the whole time at the at the shoot. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. just posted up on the block for hours. But it was like, that's that's a part of what we got going on is these interviews. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like in the city, we ain't we ain't really had that. You know what I'm saying? We ain't never had that. You know what I'm saying? See, we came to y'all. Nah, for sure. Y'all here. You know what I'm saying? This is my last job I had like two, three years ago. You know what I'm saying? We had my last job posted up. You know what I'm saying? It reminded me that I ain't never going to have a motherfucking job a day in my life again besides work for myself. You know what I'm saying? Or a big yeah. corporate. You know what I'm saying? It's a big paper. You know what I'm saying? But uh, it's a uh, real boss motivation for real. You Man. know what I'm saying? Even for y'all to be in the city. You know what I'm saying? Rocking with us. Like, for real. Like, not just... You know what I'm Skype. You know what I'm saying? It ain't no. Uh, y'all pulled up. Y'all pull are here. You know what I'm we saying? We do this. This is what we do. Not for sure. You've seen us do this in other places. Nah, nah, nah for sure. Anybody but, that's but, watching but, Boss Talk for real, they know like he'll pull up. He'll pull up. We and know. Up. But in Waco, we've been skipped over so much that we know. But we know if we get skipped over, we ain't tripping either. You know what I'm saying? No. That makes sense. Yeah, our, time I, I, we, can, our, our time coming. Our, our time is now. I you can, know what I'm saying? You we doing numbers. Crazy numbers. Two of the best artists. In Texas, we got about twenty of. Them. No, for me, uh, yeah, the ones I'm tapped like into, I'm yeah. pretty sure there's a bunch. There's a but bunch of. All I'm telling you, but is we the got two, two that, for sure. Two no, I'm, not, I'm not trying to discredit them. It's no, too no, hard. them boys, man. Listen, two of the dopest guys that I've ran into and had to, I had to interview, had to, uh, uh, you know, the the privilege privilege of interviewing. Yeah, uh, High Boy West, Waco Tron, um, uh, brothers, cousins, mm -hmm. uh, you know, it's just uh, it's just a it's just a wonderful thing to be able to tap into a great group of guys like that. So yeah. you know, um when you when you think about that interview when he said what he said, I think people I, I don't think it's something to be a ring the alarm about. I think it's something that people need to hear. I think it's something that can help people. When people see how 
these type of opportunities come and things mm-hmm. happen and you have you are young and you yeah. are making decisions with, and that you have never had to make before so mm-hmm. when you when you when you think about it it's just something that i don't i don't see how it's something to be even looked down upon i think it's something to look at to say hey man people do this and do that but lc 100 it's so many fake is, niggas man. out here and, and, and that's dare, how i took it who wouldn't that's dare I even it. say nothing real that no. real on no internet that, that's period. why i rock with we so tough like you know what i mean like he knows where i stay you know what i'm saying like um, we almost went to jail together. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I've been to that same jail before. And I was like, oh, I skipped it just a couple minutes. You know what I'm saying? Because he he had to go. You know what I'm saying? But if it was two minutes earlier, I would have went to jail with him. You know what I'm saying? So like, I feel closer, bro. Like, I understand because I've been I've been young in the game too. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Like my first mixtape, I was 16. I had Hawk, Paul Wall in there. Like, I know what it's like to to be living crazy. And I'm not on his level, you know what I'm saying? But I know what it's like to be in the city, having people pull you everywhere. And you know what I'm saying? And, and he on a whole nother level. Whole, 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 whole nother level. You know what I'm saying? Like, when, I, when we was at Thanksgiving, they brought him up at Thanksgiving. I've been rapping for years. My whole family, they don't care about the rap, but they cared when he got that deal. You know what I'm saying? It affected so many people. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So that that's that's that's... It's like he he got an opportunity and he, and he going hard. Like hey, we got so many videos that ain't even dropped yet. So like we we really ain't even dropped the best stuff yet, and we already touching men. So did you like, know that was cousin? Uh, I think I did know that. You know what I'm saying? But and it's like everybody cousins wake up. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> yeah, so yeah, you know what I, I mean? It, it, no, it, it ain't it. Like, it. not trying to be funny, I but it's, it's, it's small, like we a small city. city bro, yeah, you know what I mean? And, that, yeah. and, and like we all see, like I just said, I was shooting with Jason Anderson. Shout out to my boy Jason. You know what I'm saying? Wes pulled up. It's Tron's on the song. So Wes pulled up and just thugged on the block for hours. It's love. It's not no. Was he in the video? Yeah, he's in the video. He's popping his shit. He, he, you know what I mean. Yeah. He helping, doing what he do. He making sure that he gets what you, you he with the kids. He doing every, you know what I mean. Yeah. Like he, he yeah, really, he a, he a cool it's person. real, it's real life. You know what I'm saying. Now, as far as like, you know what I mean, like, uh, like how in the interview you talk, like you talking about uh being like number one. Yeah, everybody in the city, you know what I'm saying. Like it's a real competitive city because nobody ever done it. So yeah. I'm, I'm sure there is competition. You know what I'm saying. And shit, me and my cousins, we got competition. Me and my brothers, we got competition. You know what I mean? Like, so it's healthy competition, but it ain't no hate, no funny stuff, or no. You know, and I've I've been in this game for a minute, so you know when you could tell some ain't just connected. It's like what? In real life, it's good. You know what I'm saying? Like, but you know the fans and Waco, they they want to see who number one. Ain't nothing wrong with that, cause that's what it is, right? People want to see who coming the hardest, who getting the most numbers, you know what I'm saying, in the state. Like, the more we've been touching numbers, the more older people been tacking, tapping in with the wave, and um, they trying to see what, what y'all doing, you know what I'm saying? Like, you got to prove. You need them numbers to prove, or you need that wave to prove sometimes, you know what I'm saying? Well, just tell me how it was it coming up uh, here in Waco, just how, how it was. It was rough. How, how did you end up in, in Waco? Uh, I, I'm, a, I'm actually from, um, my, my whole family's from uh, New York. So I'm like, I'm like different. I'm Puerto Rican. You know what I'm saying? People didn't know even what Puerto Rican was back when I moved out here. You know what I'm saying? We was just, we moved out here because um, we really come from the same projects as uh, Jay-Z. We come from Best Eye. You know what I'm saying? Marcy Project. So, you know what I'm saying? It's like um, coming in Texas, like in Waco. You? You know what I'm saying? We really didn't have much. Now, what age we had to force it. I, no, I was. I came out here like they tried to stab my mom. Um, they tried to stab her when I was a baby in in her stomach. So that's what made we us all move. So you know what I'm saying? Oh, like yeah. that. That's just how it all started for me. You know what I'm saying? So they they really did it for me. You know what I'm saying? But all my brothers are from New York. All of them. You know what I'm saying? My whole family, my cousins that we just met. All of them from New York. They all moved out here. You know what I'm saying? But in Waco, we really didn't have. Entertainment. We had no blogs. We didn't have no say cheese. No nothing. Like we still kind of don't. You know what I'm saying? Like not like something that's going to be consistent every single day. Like a business. We don't have that. You know what I'm saying? So we look at y'all like, man, we need that. You know what I'm saying? So y'all being here is like big. You know what I'm saying? So we we really um we really appreciate it, but we really don't give a fuck at the same time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> well, I, but, but you know what I mean? Cause cause we ain't never had shit. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. So we ain't tripping if anybody count us out. But we appreciative of everything. Like, because if it's real, it's genuine, then shit, come rock with us. You here. You know what I'm saying? One thing I can say about you, you uh, definitely uh, um, 
like when we, when I first met you, you you was with Ronnie with Top Off, and you, what is the? How did you end up linking with Top Off? It was really, I asked. You know what I'm saying? I asked because, to be honest, like my first video was JT on my on my on my on my la on my King's Inc page. So that's the people we did graphics for everybody for uh, Charlie Boy. All these people coming up back in the day, back in the game, and I was like the artist with the team. So it's like my first video that I, I ever directed was T Wayne, Lil Ronnie, and JT, and they, that's top off. That's about as top off as it gets. I was a part of it. When they came out here, um, I, I was a part of it. I got pictures, like, one of JT's last photo shoot pictures, you know what I'm saying? When, whenever he passed away, they used my pictures, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, it, Pint inspired me, I inspired Pint, Ronnie insp inspired me. So it's like, it was really all family, and, and I started making a wave out here, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I, this is my last job, and I, I was like, I ain't never getting a job again. I'm going to work, I'm going to get it, you feel me? Yeah. Like. So I, I came to bros, I was like, man, bro, we already family. So what I got to do? And it was literally, well, really, uh, Bob, I shout out to Bob. Bob really put it in my head, like, bro, why aren't you top off? I was like, you know what, you're right. Like, because it's all family. Like, when I lived in Austin, Pint came to Austin. He, he chilled in my career. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's all family. Like, it ain't no hate. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I'm top off. You know what I'm saying? Like, when I drop music, it's top off. Like, when I do videos, it's top off. Like, the reason I got the Hot Boy West is because me and Pint did it together. So he gave me the play. So he gave me the biggest play of my career that really is changing my whole career. So I, I love Pint forever which, for which, that. Which video? Uh, my story. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. it has his intro, but I did it all. You know what I'm saying? Like, but he gave me the play. You know what I'm saying? So that, that, is that what led to dear Mr. That, Boosie? That, that what led to dear Mr. Boosie? You know what I'm saying? If it wasn't for that, it, you know what I mean? Because it's like in this game, you gotta. It's all about who locked in. Like I'm, I'm still locked in with the people from ten years ago. Like um, Charlie Boy, his song going viral on TikTok. I recorded that song, so that'd be my first plaque. If God forbid, I get a plaque. You know what I'm saying? But I'm still locked in with the same people from nine years ago, ten years ago. We still linking up. Pint's yeah, doing the video. Ronnie's in the song. Your connections are better than He's doing money. here. You know what I'm I saying? I got you to give me Charlie Boy when I was up in Houston. You know what I'm saying? I didn't even That's think bro. about it. We got it. music. Uh, we used to do all his CD covers. So King's Inc. used to do all Dirty Third CD covers. Uh, DeRoe, Ice Cream Paint Job. All those singles. Those were all done by King's Inc. So, like, we, I was in all the good. I had braids. You know what I'm saying? I'm back. I'm in there. I had a Yums deal at the time. I, I was young in the game. You know what I'm saying? Like, they gave me, when I pulled up, they gave me free shoes, opened the car, oh gave God, me four it, boxes. What's that name? Chris them with them white boy Yup, yup. Chris, yeah. uh, yeah. Yeah, but you you was with Top Off and I was I, I was just doing my own thing. I had my own thing. But here no, in Waco. I'm saying when yeah. you when you I think it was when he came to the school or something. You told me didn't didn't you and him link by that or how did you end up meeting Ronnie? I don't even really just because I work in the game. Like as far as like I work, I'm a, I'm a find. Like we don't have nothing out here, so we gotta find it. But we was all in the same circle. Like okay. everybody coming up was in the same circle. I was doing songs with. I was doing mixtape songs with everybody, you know what I'm saying? So it was like, I was the Waco guy. So when he came to Waco, he's my people, but he was already living here. So I think I just found him. I think I found him online and I was like, bro, you know what I'm saying, come through. So he came to the crib, we recorded. I picked him all the way up in uh in Woodway, you okay. know what I'm saying? So I picked him up, he came through, and we just stayed locked in, you know what I'm saying? And he went crazy. And I always knew he had it. Like, I, I remember, bro, he was um he was in the club and nobody knew him. And people was around him. And it's crazy because it's something called Circle, right? You know what I'm saying? So I, so I said, bro, you know, like, the whole like whole club around you. Like, you made a whole circle of the whole club. Like, I never seen an artist, you know, like, it's like an artist can be like a star. Mm -hmm. But he like a solar system. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, everything was revolving around him. You know what I'm saying? And I seen so many. I work with a bunch of artists. You know what I'm saying? So we... But I never seen nothing like that at the time. Like, bro, just had it. Like, we was trying. I was trying to get him to sign with King Z, and, and Big Phil said no. Nah. Like, I was, I was like, you gotta be with us. You know what I mean? Because we had a pretty good platform. We was, like, we was like the first people really shooting videos, like putting them on YouTube. Like, Pine Pine was just telling me how he seen the video me and Ronnie did, and it like he the way he did like a little boom thing inspired how he edited it. So like if you go back, you could really see all the videos. Like, you know what I'm saying? And he inspired me 
ten hundred times four. So it's like it's all family. Like you know what I'm saying. We all fuck with each other. Like so that's why me being with Top Off is not like. Like family. Other, yeah, other people they like how the fuck you get with Top Off? You 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 ain't in black. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I don't I don't look like them. I dress crazy. I'm very different. You know what I'm saying? Like it's <laughs> a good thing though. Yeah, but it's just different. You know what I'm saying? But it's really just rooted in family. Like we've been locked in for so long. Like. No matter how big I get, you know what I'm saying? Or shoot videos, I'm always gonna rip top off. Like, wow. So, who else outside of Waco, Tron, and High Boy West that would you say are, are developing quite well in the Waco area? Um, we got Timo. We got Timo. Uh, Timo got bars. Um, he's he's been on sway doing freestyles. He's hard. We got Jason Anderson. Um, man, there's so many artists. Like, I, I shoot for probably a hundred artists. A Hispanic dude out of Waco? To me, to me, I, I fuck with what the people fuck with, not what the internet fuck with. I fuck uh -oh. with, you know what I'm saying? No, yeah, that's real yeah, shit. That's real. Because I'm out here, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm an artist and I shoot videos. I'm out here, I see everything. I see behind the scenes. I see everything. And I, and I want to I wanna see, when them tell me you hot. Not a post, because anybody could get posts. You know what I'm saying? That, that post shit, that shit cool. Well, you, who, you who, it, folks. It's the it's the people that decide. The people don't decide. You don't decide what's hot. The people decide what's hot. You know what I'm saying? We were just talking about Yellow Beezy. The people decided that's on me. Yeah. I thought Trapping Designer was harder song. Me too. I was like, I, I, when he thought when he dropped that, I thought that blew up. So it's like it's 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 really up to the people. You know what I'm saying? But there's like uh, there's a lot of dope artists. Like I can't even really just think because I shoot for so many and like my mind be so blurry. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What's the uh when you think about just the, the the camera of choice nowadays, that you would if you had your choice to pick any camera, I'm not that type of person. What kind of camera would you buy? I'm not that type of person. What kind of camera do you use nowadays? I can shoot a video on my iPhone, and I can shoot content with my iPhone, or I got a 360 camera. I, I would say my 360 camera because I was the first artist in Texas to drop a 360 video. So you could put my video on the Oculus, and you could see everything in real time while while my girls walking over here. Uh, their shoes. I'm rapping over here when my girl's walking over here. When you could pause it and see it in real time on the Oculus, or you could watch it on YouTube and you can move it. And you could you could pretty much since I'm a director, you can direct a video with me. So it's like I feel like that would be something different because I like different shit. You know what I'm saying? But as far as like what's the biggest camera, I don't I don't never shoot like that. I pull up with a backpack, pull up in the hood. People doing crazy shit and I'm gonna record it. You know what I'm saying? Like that's my style. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a technical person. I have to try to be better at that. You know what I'm saying? That's like one of my downfalls. But uh, I, I just be, it's a you, feeling. You know what I'm saying? I love the way you cut and, on that, dear Mr. Boosie. When you were making those scenes and those cuts and the way you were looking at that, how did you come up with how you wanted to lay it out? I don't. I don't be thinking. Like my brain, I don't think of when I create about art. I don't plan. It wasn't no plan. He picked me up early. He said, have, it just have the whole day. So we came until the cops came. We, we filmed till the cops came, shut everything down. You know what I'm saying? Till I, I could, my, uh, they ain't even had no Ubers. They, Uber wouldn't even come to the hood. And I had to call some random girl. Some random girl picked me up, took me home. You know what I'm saying? So it was like, <laughs> did you like the song when he first, you first Super heard? hard. Super hard. And he been done did that song. So it already was a Waco classic. I found that out. It was already a Waco classic. And, he did it on a bigger level. Boosie posted it. It can't get you no know, like when I shot a video for Pee Wee Longway, I sent it to their management. He's like, "Oh, the, the Boosie video? I seen it already. You did that? You know what I'm saying? So it ain't no telling who I seen. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I, when I flew to Atlanta to talk to the manager, to you know, I'm trying to work. You know what I mean? I'm like, hey, I might shoot a video for you. He, so I'm just kind of bringing up what I do. He's like, oh yeah, do do do. So he already seen it. So it ain't no telling how many people seen. It. And that's when it really clicked in my mind. Like, okay. We're doing something special, you know what I'm saying? Because numbers are cool. Like, I don't care about numbers. You know what I mean? Numbers are fabricated. I'm a marketer. We've been marketing digital marketing for about twelve years, so we can make we can make numbers all day. You know what I'm saying? But what is the people really feeling like when we went in the club? Them people singing, "Dear Mr. Boosie, work for it." I'm rapping it too. I'm rapping it like it's my song. You know what I'm saying? We gonna put we gonna put that in the video, like in the clip, like people rapping it word for word, like they fucking with it. You know what I mean? This is like. It's been a minute since I've seen or been really a part of something like this. Like, like damn, they, you know what I'm saying? I mean, Thick Fine Woman is going crazy, too, on TikTok. Yeah, I just seen that. You know what I'm saying? Like, but that was nine years ago. You know what I'm saying? 
That happened nine years ago when we recorded that. You know what I'm saying? This is happening now. now. That's crazy though. No, that's that's a his that's a historic moment though, right there. Like, I could get a plaque for that. I could bring a plaque to my mama for that shit. Like that shit crazy to me. No, like, but that, that's off, the way, off of the video shit, off of the that's rap. That's the way the internet. You know is. what I'm saying? That's the way like, the internet do. But I just want one because to pop my shit. You know what I'm saying? Because I rap. I got an album coming out. I do my rap shit, and that shit cool. I do my videos, and that's really what's working for me. But then I'm gonna get a plaque as an engineer. Wow. So you know do, what I'm saying? You, do you when you think about just that's different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because of course you you've been working. So when you work, you, you, big work pays off. Yeah. So when you when you um, look at the the new videos that you've been doing for, because um, you done another one, didn't you for Hot Boy? The one that ain't came out is the craziest though. Yeah. We pushing it to a whole nother limit. We going as raw as you can get. We, I might go to jail for shooting these videos, but we cool with it. <laughs> How in the hell are you going to jail shooting the videos? Because we doing we got crazy shit in the videos that you ain't gonna see in other people's videos. Damn. And I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna be out there. Y'all doing this. Shit. Yeah. Mm. For real. It's, it sounds crazy, but when you from the mud, you ain't got nothing. What, what you gonna do? You gonna miss out? You gonna say, nah, I'm a, I'm a chill. I'm a chill. Nah, I gotta go home. I ain't got no kids. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got no girl. Let's go. So you basically got, you gonna take a chance on this? We gonna take a chance? No, nah, we all we all trying to just make some. It, like it's just about like not caring about taking a chance. Was, I don't care about that type when of that, stuff. Cause that dear Mister Boost, it it didn't did it a special. million. It did a mil fast. million. Fast. It did a million faster than I, I think the other videos. Even fast, like it hit it faster than the song with Gucci Man did. If, if you if, if you really Mr. check Boosie. it, it hit a million faster than the song with Gucci Man. Like. Like that's manifestation Cause three Four years ago I dropped a song With Zaytoven Called Gucci Man And it was misspelled Because I had a Gucci chain You know what I'm I saying I remember that You remember that You know what I'm saying So I was I've been manifesting This shit for a long time So I ain't finna miss out On nothing God got me I'm a, I'm a kill it I'm gonna show up for him I'm gonna I'm a do a good job We gonna kill it And, and we been doing it Like the video We had, we got two videos That we ain't even dropped The one that He ain't even seen it is the craziest. Like I said, we pushing it. So like it's raw like back in the day videos, like, is this real? To my dad. This ain't like acting. Shit. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know, you see videos where Chief Keith is back in the day, it's like they in the room. Okay, but we outside. This ain't no acting. This is this ain't like a, a controlled space. This is real like, is this real? What is this? You know what I'm saying? So that's just my style or what I'm trying to create. Uh, with him So I don't want to just do his videos I want to create us a style I want to create us a vibe That nobody else got And like Lil Kiki tapped in on the Instagram this morning Kali um, Royce the 5'9 tapped in on it Like I shot a video for Royce And he tapped in And now he's tapping in on his So it's like They looking at it They understand it The big dogs understand What we're doing They see this is different This is totally different This is new Y'all doing it together So I feel like the more we do it, the better it's getting. And like, even if we don't do any more, we done did it. We done created the style. You know what I'm saying? Like, we done did it. And this new one finna, like, it's 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 going crazy. You know what I'm saying? Like, in our city, we never really seen nothing go crazy like this. Have you ever shot for Waco, Tron? Yeah, we got a, uh, he got like three videos. I shot like three videos on my channel. How, like, did, we they shot, How did they do? We shot, um, Two videos on my channel before he got signed, and we actually shot right when he got signed. We shot a toothpaste, and we shot another one, but they shelved it. Yeah. They shelved both of them videos, and he reshot them with somebody else. Okay, so you because of deal label deals and, and the way they wanted. I, I don't know what, but I, I got paid. It was all good business, and I didn't ask no questions. Yeah, how 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 is Flex and Fab who who you introduced me to? That's my brother. We just dropped a crazy video uh, too. Like I said, um. We shut down the mall. We was in the mall doing crazy stuff, and we got girls everywhere. You know what that I'm saying? Don't surprise. He's a real like, like he wild, like you know what I'm saying? How's he doing? How how's nah, he, he's doing? He's doing. He's doing. He's doing good. Tobin still building a relationship. Yeah, I'm trying to get him to shoot one of the songs. He got so much song. He's working. Um, he's working in the studio heavy on music right now, but he just always pushing. Like he a flexer. You know what I'm saying? Like when we get together, we really. I have to force him to talk about music. You know what I'm saying? Does that make sense? Like. He don't really be We be dripping We be We be on some girls We be also having fun We be in to get some bottles Cause you know I do OnlyFans too Damn So we be on some other you type You got an OnlyFans page? I got an OnlyFans page You know what I'm saying what I film girls How, How's it? Onlyfans.com Slash you money the they, king They paying you to watch you and stuff? Mm-hmm. 
So, hey, can I be on there? What y'all gonna do? That's bro. I'm with the girls. No, look, there's girls on there, and then I'm on girls only fans because if I want a guy, if he come to my only fans, he not gonna see me. But I'll be on the girls only fans. But I don't want, I want, I don't want my fans to come be like, oh man. I went to Geo Page and you yeah. know what I mean? Like, he got a I, like, I want to yeah. give people what they want to see. You feel me? They want to see them girls, don't they? want to see them girls. They're going to go to my page, see the girls I, I rock with. How you don't do your OnlyFans? I've been thinking about this for a long time, but my image, I'm like, man, I'm, like I said, I'm not caring no more. I'm just going to do it. It ain't nothing about image, man. We all, we all grown, man. We all I just making content. It's business. You know what I'm saying? We all making content on any. And I, I record for Christian you artists. Said, you I'll be in the kids, church. Though. You don't have kids. I don't have kids. I got a daughter. Well, we all I make decisions. You that. done, you done got your nut. Got <laughs> you done got that nut. It's off. Nah, it ain't really. You off. know what I mean? It's, it it's really off into the it's, world. It's just hard about trying to hide it. It ain't off now. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm just saying you I got it off. I don't care about doing it. That motherfucker gone. I won't care about doing it. It landed, like, and, and you got to you got to deal with all the decisions from where it landed. I'm thinking. Ain't no wrong it. with I'm it. Still thinking about that's it. a be- that's the most beautiful gift creation I mean, as a creator. Content. That's the most beautiful content you can create. I got the content. You know what I'm saying? A kid is the most beautiful thing you can make. Nah, I'm talking about I got the content for the for the for the only fans. I just ain't did it. You just gotta find the fans and push it out there. I Man, I got bro, it's I'm a bad inf- see, I'm no, a bad you're influence. Not. Because it's people on Facebook and told me to do it like like do it like bro, drop one. I'm like, bro, what the hell? Like Because the world different nowadays. I know. There's gonna be guys that are gonna come to your page just to do that. They gonna watch it. I know. And I know that. That's why I don't put mine on mine. Cause that's weird. Yeah, <laughs> bro. Listen, and that's a really, fact. That's what no, it is. Really you don't watch P Valley? It's, no, hell no. Have you seen P Valley? I've never seen. My P-Bally. home girl made me watch an episode of it. I watched it this week. What was my, it? my boo made me, my girl that I be hitting made me watch that show just because I came to hit her and she made me watch it. What it was, was it? a lot of crazy shit. What the world it? different. What was it? People, people like every people like seeing dudes. What? I'm just saying the world is open. It's an open world. It's not people are there's lifestyles. People are gay. People are open. People are different. You know what I'm saying? There's different lifestyles. People have different lifestyle choices. Like about, to me, I got, I'm what, open what, what to every about, lifestyle. Polygamists. What about, what about morals and standards and 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 things that you won't violate? Is I there have, any I have, integrity no, I, I have in my anything moral, that you do? I have my morals of what I do. There's no I sexual uh uh there is no uh uh Sexual standards for you? There's, it's a free world to do whatever you, you for want. me now. As far as what I just accept, whatever, what people do, whatever. No, whatever. You, you control, down for whatever? I have, I have to accept what I can't control. Nobody say, are you down for whatever though? No, I just said I'm not. No, 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 no. I'm a straight only women. Uh, you know what I'm saying? That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? Hey, but you can't, you can't change the fact that like I can't change other like, people. Like I can't saying, change like what saying, the world is. I, the I make an only fan page and I put it out there. I said you can't stop niggas from watching it. You, you can't, can. you can't. If How? they go and research it, that's cool. But I don't want my uh, fan that goes to say, "Hey, I'm a fan of Giovanni the King. I'm finna go see it, and he gonna see my stuff." But why does it matter? <laughs> I'm not doing the money. I'm what's getting the money. I told him what, what's the bigger I'm picture. I'm getting then? the money. What's the bigger picture? You getting the money or you? I'm getting or, the money. So it's he, like break down the. Exactly. Exactly. You, you talking about more standards? Break, break me you down. More break standards, down. Right? I want to know how you sit, how your OnlyFans page is set up. I have other girls on there. And then you could upsell. It's a business, you know what I'm saying. Okay. You could upsell and send it to direct people, or okay. have content that only certain people could see. But I have content, and I showcase the people I make content for. I get paid to make content, and I also upsell content on my OnlyFans. So do yeah you do you have one or you? Sell? I have. If you go to OnlyFans slash my name, just like my Instagram, I got my own OnlyFans. But do you like? Do yeah, me you? and my me and my. I don't put my. I mean. I don't put myself on my own OnlyFans, but, but I, I am own. on there. I am on girls' as OnlyFans. Oh, For yeah, sure. you're knocking girls down on their OnlyFans. On their page. But I don't want, if, if somebody's my fans, I don't want them nah, to come bro. to my page and be like. You want to be long, don't King Kong. I just, do, I just want to get my money and go home. <laughs> yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't you want see to, that. You don't want to get my money and go home. page and just be sitting on that hoe like this. But I got I got fans from all kinds. Of, I do all kinds of stuff. You see how I'm you know saying, what I'm saying? though? You get what I'm saying? Sit right I got there. little kid fans out here. Whoa. No, I got little kid fans. When I go in the hood, little kid. When I step outside, little kids. Oh, you shoot this, you shoot that. I can't step outside without little kids seeing me. So I don't want a little kid to type in my name and then see me on there. You know what I'm they saying? You get what I'm saying? Though. They gotta pay for it. No, they leak them sometimes. You could, you could, you, you could. bro. 
Bro, it's blog. Somebody will pay that, put it on the blog, do this. You know what I'm saying? It's just that's cool, bro. That's more that, exposure. That's just my for me. choice. And, and that's more exposure. Hey, I'm and not sure. You can create your page and you can you can conduct it how you want it. You know what I'm saying? Bro, mine's like, gonna be open to everybody. I want the money. I don't care about what y'all thinking. No, nah, I, I, I don't really care. It's more for me of what I wanted because I, I have it. fans because I've yeah. been I've been making content for many years. For a long time. You know what I'm saying? I know what I'm cool with. I'm cool with myself. You know what I'm saying? I don't care if people call me whatever. I'm good. I know when I lay down, I'm good with me. But I'm and saying that's what I care about. I'm saying in this way. Like, no, I'm no. saying if I make an OnlyFans page, like me and some girl over there, and it's like I put it out, and then some gay people want to come watch my my channel. I mean, that's cool. Because they're not wrong with they're, that. They're not actually seeing me. They're actually going to buy my. No, content they're going to come. Me. That's cool. No, <laughs> they're going to come. come at me like this, especially me. They're going to come check me out. I'm like, bro. They come. I'm just giving it to them. What they exactly. gonna do? Not just that. I'm just saying. Some of my friends, boys gonna come. My cousins. No, I'm not. I'm not worried about. Damn. I'm not worried about what type of people. I'm talking about friends. Anybody might. Man, you do some I crazy. People gonna check it out. People are gonna check yeah, it out. Yeah, they gonna check it out. That's how you get the money. That's you how mean, you get so the you, money. You cool with your family and everybody? No, I don't care what they say about me. They are they gonna black sheep anyway. So I don't care what they. I say. don't want them bringing to my mama. But now you know. what Bro, I'm saying? my mom. I, I would tell her. She might be. My mama would tell her. What you gonna tell her? My mama, I got this going on. She gonna say, long as you right. My mama is like me. No, I mean, she I don't mean, care. I mean, but look, the more money I get, the more things might change. So you might, be you know, open, what I'm saying, you might be open to dropping. But I'm making fans. more money anyway. I'm making the money anyways. Like it's not like that's my only job. That's not like my that. only thing. You know what I mean? That's yeah. just one piece of content. I do all fifty di different things of content. I'm just saying that's just I get you, part bro. of it. I get you. You know what part I'm saying? Part of it. Which one of your so the, is the dear Mr. Boosie? Which vi which video has the most views in life? My story, I think. My story. I think my story does. Wow. How did that make you feel to know that you accomplished that? It was cool. I was just happy that it came out. I just wanted it to come out. You know what I'm saying? Like, it ain't about numbers for me. It's about um, doing what I wanted to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I made that song, Gucci Man. I bought the chain. You know what I'm saying? Like, I only called it Gucci Man because they told me did the beat. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? So it really meant something to me. And it, it really, I was going through a lot. You know what I mean? It motivated me. So when I got that, it was like, I, I got it. Because I shot a, I shot a diss um, for Hot Boy West. Not me, but I shot the video for an artist that dissed him. And it hit like 100,000 on my page. So there was like a lot of people creating the narrative. Like I had a problem with him. Um, with because we West? never worked. Yeah, we never worked. So when we finally got to work, it really squashed the narrative that everybody put upon me. Like, I'm just trying to get some money. I don't make a tons of money off doing videos or, you know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. it, it, you know what I mean? I'm here in Waco. I don't charge what y'all charge in Dallas for videos. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's different. I got to hit the road. I got to go make my money. So I'm, I'm trying to get paid. I didn't know it was a diss. I came and did four videos that same day, and that was the second one. And it went crazy. So that really squashed. Did you People know? putting shit on me. You know what I'm saying? Putting yeah. that jacket on me like, oh, you're a hater because he blew up. I was happy as fuck. Did Hot Boy West? That's going to change my life, and I knew it would. Did he, Hot Boy West, did you and him ever talk about the diss song? No, but whenever we shot the video, he kind of he kind of said something that stuck out to me like, man, it's all about getting money. Fuck yeah, all that shit. That's what he shit. be saying. That's it's all him. about getting some money. That's him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And he... And he we connected on some shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, he know I ain't on no fuck shit. I ain't on no extra shit either. You know what I'm saying? But now we we cool. You know what I'm saying? I say we cool. Like, but at the time, man, you, know, you know, you gotta, you know I'm walking on. in a room just like he talking about with Boosie. I'm walking in a room with uh 30 people, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That I don't even know that it, what it could be. But I'm, I'm coming here to work. People exactly. gonna respect that, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, you. one thing about me, I'm gonna shoot for everybody. You ain't never gonna find out what happened, where it was. You never gonna get no beef in between or this person showed up and started something. I shoot for everybody in this little small city. So people respect that. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna I'm come in and do my job and go home. You know what I'm saying? And that's really all it was about. And he, yeah. he kind of was, I, I felt, and I, we never really talked about it, but I felt like he was kind of just like, we get some money together. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, shit, now we, I feel like we changing the game. You know what I'm saying? Like, Cause when I shoot his videos, I'm thinking like of him. You know what I'm saying? Like he's spe he's a special artist. I've been around a lot of artists. He's a special artist. You know what I'm saying? Like he, I'm ready to risk it because I see him ready to to go in. I like that. You know what I'm saying? That's like war. We at war right now 
with with the, with no. You know what I'm saying? You when you just think about where you want to go with this, how how what's what's the what's the end game for you? Um, I see myself. I've always seen myself as being like an A and R or like a. It's just different because I, I I don't. I live for the now, and I can only control the now. And I'm and I'm blessed to be here now. And sometimes when we look too far, we like don't appreciate the now. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't know where I'll be. You know what I'm saying? But I know I've been doing this since I was like screwing chopping. You know what I'm saying? Hawk was on my first mixtape, so that'll tell you my first mixtape. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't never stopped doing it. I I stopped girls. You know what I'm saying? I stopped messing with girls. I didn't kick them out. I didn't got in fights. I didn't, you know what I'm saying? I done fell out with people. I never stopped doing music, ever. You know what I'm saying? So I probably own a label or something. You know what hey, I'm what's saying? what's the best video you ever think you shot? Not, Dear not Mr. Because, Boosie. Not because of numbers. I'm saying just because of the one you shot. Thank the, you. Dear Mr. Boosie. And before that, it was Big Binky Hammer on the block because we had the whole hood out there. I'm talking about about a thousand people and I was yelling people, scoot back, scoot back. So if you don't know about Big Binky, he was on a Scarface. You know what I'm saying? Real one. So he like a legend in the city. Legend in the city. So that was the biggest video until the Dear Mr. Boosie because we walked in the club and the whole club is singing it word for word. Like the whole club. Dear Mr. Boosie. Dun, and dun, it's a dun. flow. You know what I'm saying? We ain't, he didn't even drop he didn't even drop the hardest songs. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like we ain't dropped the original music yet. So it's all flows pretty much. He got this thing where he's just organic and he's killing the game right now. I, I mm -hmm. tell people that he's the hottest artist in Texas. Facts. No, I'm saying. And, and that's why I feel like I, I'm popping my and, shit because and, and I'm, I'm we shooting it, it together. Listen, like He might be the hottest artist in the South altogether. Facts. I'm being real. Yeah, nigga, hard. Royce hard, the 5'9". I'm going to tell you something. Royce the 5'9 is tapping in. He a lyricist. Listen to me. Boosie tapping in. He the hood. Listen to me. Hot Boy West, the reason I picked him to do these interviews like I've been doing and I bring him up every time is because I know that he's the best to do it right now for me. I don't know what everybody else think, and I really don't care. Yeah, I've always been that way. I told him. What I you this, think? When check, I heard that song check. big time, I already knew it. When I heard that yeah, song big time, a big, I told him we're big fans. Oh, yeah. Boss oh, yeah. Talk 101 is big fans. Before, before we was even cool, West, I was playing him at the at the strip club. I was working in the strip club. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> when I worked here, I worked in the strip club too. You know what I'm saying? I'll be up there with me and my girl, post up at the strip club. She wait on me every day, you know what I'm saying, to make sure I was good and not doing nothing crazy. And I'll be playing his music every single day because it it, it was organic. It's something different, bro. It was organic. It was good before I knew what it was. It was good. You know what I'm saying? And Waco, Waco championed him. So it's different when the streets, when the, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to go with the people. You know what I'm saying? So if the streets talking about it and they say, you got to play this, you got to play it. He's still the hottest artist in Texas, maybe in the South. Hot Boy West is probably the hottest. I, I don't care as far as new up and coming artists right now. It's hard to deal with that dude he when it comes down to lyrics and the way he handling his game. I don't see nobody really just get doing it the way he doing and raw as he is. He too real. Yeah, he speak his mind. He more yeah, like that's, he that's got why like I'm a telling soldier you, slim to Pac feel. No, bro. we finna go raw. He he, just, he's finna go raw. Like raw than the that. shit finna go raw. <laughs> because I see what you saying that he's it's that real. I'm 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 I a student of the game too. So I'm looking at them like, how can we go raw? Yeah. What can we do? Can we do something new? Yeah. What's what's new? So. And, and it's not me. I'm not saying that it's me. I'm just I'm just trying to bring the, the most out of it. How As a you, director, I'm trying but, to bring more out of it. But as one that's working with him and being that he's on the label with 1017, do you feel like there's boundaries that you should not overstep as you make these certain moves? I really don't do too much of shit. <laughs> what you mean? Hey, let's go. We don't talk. What, what, what boundaries? You know there's what no mean? boundaries. I shoot. Let's go. But if it's something that could affect him in a negative way or, or, or crazy. Then they won't put it out because they see it first. They see it first. Cool. I send it to them. You know what I'm saying? You have to work through the label to work with Hot Boy West. No. I mean, I mean. You just said you sent I it mean, to I mean, I work with him. I work with the label. I work with. It's all. How did you. How did, if, if, they, if, 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 he, if he forgets the link, I got to send it to somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Like, or so, You know what I mean? Like. It all goes through. If we need a, a minor alteration or something, you know what I'm saying? We take care of it, like, you know what I'm saying? But I, I, 
It's whatever. You know what I'm saying? But there's no, like, why can't we push the boundaries? Like, that. that's kind of my thing is, like, nobody's ever said not to. Not to push the boundaries. No, don't change the game. Like, who who's going to tell us not? You think Gucci Mane's going to say, hey, go less raw? He might. <laughs> but shit. I just know y'all, that mean, Mr. Shit. Boosie was real. That whole had, you had old women in it with, with pistols and yep. dun, 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 dun. Have y'all been to Waco? <laughs> no, nah, that whole okay, going well, in. Okay, welcome to Waco. <laughs> That's the way it go down. Welcome to Waco. In his hood. We didn't shoot anything crazy. We had a he had a block party. We was just out in his. That was all love. Like that's all his people. All his people. They they when when he comes out, that's how they come out. I mean, even with even if it's not his people, they come out. They love the kids him. come out. The old people come out. My, they come uh, my out. partner from Bell Me. Like I'm I'm from Waco, but I'm from the mud. I'm from the trailer park of Bell Me. You know what I'm saying? The meth capital. You know what I'm saying? So they come out. My partner I grew up with came out. Was getting autographs from him with his son. You know what I'm saying? Can you hold the picture of Giovanni for me? You know what I'm saying? Even though we go back 10 years, it's affecting people's lives. What about you know what I'm saying? Some people say that he has... Because like Waco ain't never seen no shit like that. He like a soldier slim. Like the, the hood love him like that. Facts. Facts. Are you, while earlier you spoke on Pee Wee Longway. Real you, one. What, you, you, when you went to meet him, what, how did that happen? Um, Went to Atlanta. Uh, we had a dope ass studio. We shot with him. We didn't have much time. I finessed the shoot. I had like, he came, showed up. You know what I'm saying? Like he was late, and I told him it's all good. I'm used to this. I'm used to handling it. He showed up with ten minutes left. I got him in the building. I did four takes within nine minutes. Got the studio wrapped up. It was good. We came outside. We chilled. Did what we had to do. You know what I'm saying? Real one. You know what I'm saying? Was willing to do more outside because we didn't have time. We could have got more time, but. It was just so much that we didn't did it. It was like a moment, like, damn, bro, we did the whole motherfucker right now. It was like so clean that he was just like, shit, you good? He seen the video, post the video. His people's cool. Like we showing love in Atlanta. Like, how did you, real how one. Did you like, link with him though? I got booked. Oh, he, I got he, booked he with called, an artist. He reached out to you? No, I got booked with an artist that shot with him. Uh, but when I, because like, I reached out to him afterwards, was like, can we possibly shoot? Um, but it was the same weekend uh, Thug and then went to jail So it was kind of different in Atlanta yeah. Nobody was trying to do anything extra at that point You know what I'm saying So And I knew that So I wasn't even tripping about the vi I wasn't even talking about the video Whenever we linked up But um, Yeah his manager seen the Boosie video and everything So it was kind of like He knew it was some Like he knew it was good And the video was good We had models We had everything We had girls going live And everything ready for him And like It's good who would you like to work Good with? Good business. Who would you like to work with uh, moving forward? Anybody that sticks out to you? Lil Ronnie. You like to work with Lil Ronnie? Lil Ronnie. You a bad boy. He's so picky. He don't like my style. He don't? He don't. But that's he's like my, one of my favorite artists. Yeah, you know but you don't, you of all time. Me, believe me, he see you. He see no, you. that's my brother. But he see you. But we, we so family, like my friends right here. We so family, we can say that to each other and not have a feeling hurt about it. Yeah, but, but he see you. Nigga, your videos need to be like this. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I'll be like, I know. Yeah, but no. You, you know, like I mean, you asked me about what camera. I don't know what camera. Yeah, but you just. I'm not you, that guy. Yeah, that was me when when Fresh pulled up the shoot, he like, you got, we going to be the hood. All right, pop the shit right now. We going to shoot a video right here, right now? Pine to be like, damn, we shooting a video right now? Yeah, yeah. We, but but I'm, out right now. But I'm just I'm just thinking about the fact that you you did that dear Mr. Boosie and that whole went to a million man. Man, we don't care about numbers. No, 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 we don't no, care no, about no numbers. You can say that. You can say that. We don't. But people looking, man. I don't care what you say. We're on a video. We don't. No, you think it was a we video? Or name of the song. No. If we really cared about it, it I would feel it certain type of way. We don't. You gotta care realize how boy West is rapping on that whole man. It is not just no damn. Uh, you can just throw anybody on that hole. It don't work like that. It don't work. You no, couldn't get that, that with. I'm just you, 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 but, song. but the thing is, if that's my brother and I know what he wants, and I know that's not the type of shit that I do, why would I press him and force him to do something that he don't want to do? No, I ain't telling you to do that. that that's kind of what I'm saying. Like, All I'm saying is that was a hell of a hell of a song. He see it. You keep working. If you keep on working like you working and making those kind of hits like you just done, oh, they know. Ain't yeah, nobody stupid, bro. But that's bro. how you push. You know what I'm saying? If yeah, that's no, what. No. Hey, listen, that that. Uh, it's a half pint film, bitch. That hoe was so popular when Yellow got hot, man. Everybody wanted a damn half, uh, half, half pint, pint video, video, man. You can't yeah. tell me it don't matter. It matters. I had it matters. Man, 
It matters. Pop off is a different type of group. I don't give a damn. It matters. <laughs> and, 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 and if it would have mattered, with a that, group of niggas and, and, and people it and brothers, it would have mattered to like, have paint. You know what I'm saying? Like that. that. Then basically, we're a brotherhood. Don't matter. You know what I'm saying? Like, is it is it a rap group? No. Do we rap I'm, together? Or we, no. We're all brothers. I'm saying is, you know what I'm all I'm saying is. I want him to have the best product ever. If you keep dropping those hits like you doing and making those videos and the moves you've been making, brother, I've been watching you. Nick can't deny you, man. You know, you're going to be a force to be, you are a force to be reckoned with in your own zone. For sure. And really being a Puerto Rican? Yeah. That give you leverage, nigga. Don't play me. I, I feel like it gives me you know negative nah, leverage. That, nah, wow. that give you leverage, You want to know why? Niggas you love be real? to go let's, to the other race and do everything, Let's nigga. talk about you it. You ain't let's. applying yourself. Jeff Adair, nigga, I can name him, nigga. Uh, well, what's that nigga name over there? Prophecy Films, nigga. Don't yeah. play me, nigga. Yeah. Being light-skinned, that nigga out here is a privilege, nigga. Don't play you. My wife yeah, right there, hell, she we, light we, we, we light-skinned Y'all niggas in, got privilege, in, in Texas. Nigga. Dark niggas don't get those same privileges, nigga. Hey, there's a big bear. Whenever Look at them niggas' heads go like this. They didn't put, they didn't put me in uh Nigga know he ain't getting no privileges when you dog, nigga. You can go out here and these niggas gonna buy, nigga. They gonna spend. You can raise yeah. your price up and don't even realize that these niggas gonna buy from you. All you gotta do is tell niggas it's, it's more now. Them yeah, but yeah, yeah. I, I, I don't, to me, I don't see race, gender. I don't give I don't a damn what you see. I'm no. telling you what the world see, No, nigga. but, <laughs> but in, in the game, in the game, it's, it's, it's separate. Those guys are doing well and I'm gonna tell you, it's the guys like the Jeff Adairs, it's the guys like like the, uh, but there's black directors film. too, though. No, nah, but these niggas right here, they getting a different type of bag, nigga. You go over there, ask them how what their price is. Jeff Adair over there, he, I know that price right, yeah, nigga. Yeah, I, look at, yeah, yeah, yeah. But they've been doing it for a minute. Nah, it don't matter. Been doing some it people minute. been doing it just as long as him ain't got that price yeah. like that, bro. Oh, yeah, for sure. Shit, come on, man. Stop, man. It matters. But as, as far According as like being, to being actuals a, but being and a what we're Rican, doing, though, oh, that's a, that's but a plus. being a Puerto Rican is You're not using it right, dog. No, but being a Puerto Rican, we got to deal with not being black, not being Mexican. Even we're Afro Latinos. So it if don't you matter. go back to the roots, no, we're all black. I'm telling you is you're doing a good job. Don't Spanish waste people. your opportunity. Oh, no. Tighten up. No. Nigga, you headed to the moon. Get your chin no, strapped. It's already tight. there. It's already there. You know what I'm saying? It's already there. You just got a different sway. I think it's yeah. just more. Dude, take advantage of the fact that you hot right now. You on a wave, and make sure you capitalize off of it. Get your oh, name, every day. brand that hold to every where. Day. I, you I just shot with Young Buck last week. He was fucking with it. You know what I'm young saying? Young Buck shot with him last week. How, you, how'd you link up with him? I got booked. The nigga call you? No, the people they they, they they when you come in town, they gonna call me. They gonna book me. You need somebody, a video. You oh, need somebody, somebody big. At this point, if you need somebody, if it ain't, if you if you ain't going up to half pint getting the big money, you gonna they gonna call me. Niggas say they coming to me. Smoothie, nigga. you know what I'm saying? They Smoothie call me. booked you? Uh, no, nah, uh, when uh, uh, I got a big video with him and uh, Texarkana upon the TSC Big Red. He a dope artist. You gotta tap in yeah, with him. Stay in my DM. TSC Big Red. Stay in my DM. Smart artists. You know what I'm saying? Hard. He stay with your B. He trying to get on boss top. <laughs> nah, but the, uh, shout out to TSC Big Red. He gonna work. He working. He working. Damn, I do. Shout out to my boy he Suicide. Mm -hmm. Nah, for sure. So you watching him? Nope. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Nah, he got some shit though. He's money, money Moses. Question, bro. Look, I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, artist that the I know he works every time show, he drops me. Right? He drops. I can show you my DM. And every time he drops me, I believe. I believe. Everybody in your DM, nigga, you money Moses. Nah, that's for sure. Boss top one on one. That's for sure. Yeah, no, nah, but there's artists hard, in every part of the state that, that, that's that's I work with artists every part of the state. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I throw shows too. You know what I'm saying? So I throw shows. They'll come down and show, kill it. How's the music going? Nah, I do. The music going good. Though. I'm finna drop a you new like album. I host it one time. Yeah, cause you're a good dude, man. Son, I got a good review. What's his name? Red. Let me go, uh, TSC Big Red, yeah, TSC the Stoners Committee. I shot all his videos. Uh -huh, we building his whole channel. It's going crazy already. He just he just been dropping music. But the song with Smoothie yeah, going super started. crazy. Damn, I gotta I gotta ask Smoothie about it. Smoothie them music Smoothie, him. Smoothie will tell you we had the model and she got a little too drunk. That's my homegirl. And she fell on her face in the middle of the shoot and we were scared. Damn. She fell. She was like, Damn. When you bring Smoothie on, tell him to bring up that he story. He coming. I just talked to him earlier before I came Smoothie over. Smoothie real he he, he, he real cool. I you fuck with Smoothie. Huh? He just nah, was on the phone with us earlier. Nah, for sure. We all we love all y'all, man. Y'all family, man. To uh, me, to me, I'm only as big as the artists I shoot. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't take none of shit as me. I'm just I'm just living in the moment. You know what I'm saying? Like like with Mike Fresh, we shoot videos. Like we don't we not playing the shit. We not thinking about the shit. We just organically linking up, making some shit. 
You know what I'm saying? And trying to make it as big as possible every step of the way. Man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, how can people get a hold day? Uh OnlyFans.com slash Giovanni the King. Go subscribe. Uh yeah. TikTok slash I spy GTK. GTK shopping. You're gonna find me. You're gonna see my little head, my sticker pop up. You know what I'm saying? GTK, the G stand for Javinci, you know what I'm saying? You just gonna see it. Bad yeah, nigga, man. We came down to Waco so we could rock out with you. Nah, I appreciate y'all for sure. Come we, on, man. We ain't never had no shit like this in Waco. Yeah, we here today. Nah, we ain't never had no shit like yeah, this in Waco. We in this hole today. For real? Yeah, we Am we, I lying? Am I capping? I can't. We ain't never had no shit like this in Waco. That's why. That's why. They said the same thing when I went you know down to New Orleans. They said the same thing when I went to Houston over there. When I was downtown by the airport. They said the same thing when I was in Chicago. They said, man, we popping up everywhere. They said the same thing mm -hmm. we was in Atlanta the last three times. Atlanta. We said the same thing we was in L.A. We just hit L.A. the same way downtown, the showroom, man. Then we hit Vegas, man. They said the same thing. Nigga, guess what? Nigga, we here. And you yeah, can catch sure. me over there at my studio, too, at my spot where you came, nigga. Yeah, we nah, everywhere. For sure. Nigga, Irving is our turf nigga holla at your boy man yeah. it's a hey. unique hustle love and light <laughs> hey hey make sure you get the new album love and light i'm finna drop that i got west on there you know what i'm saying oh, yeah. i got west i got little flip i got um magno on there and then my partner mike serving he did the jesus christ he did my yeah, intro you got that magno so, on yeah. that how you that's my brother magno, nigga? i used to be in uh a wildlife affiliate like i used to be in the group with magno <laughs> like that's my brother he really taught me everything Everything like about how I move and how like I appreciate shit. Like he be like we be on the phone hours. Like he he teach me so much. Like since years, he was like the only artist like back in the day that really 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 fucked the Waco. Like him, Tum Tum. Like those are the people that that really just fucked with us. Like they came out here consistently. They still fuck with us. Like Damn. so. That's shout dope. to Magno. You know what I'm saying? Cop the album. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get Tum on there. We can see if we get it by next week. But yeah, love and light. You know what I'm saying? Man, thank you so much for coming on the show, my guy. Man, I appreciate y'all for coming. Man, anytime, bro. If you need me to pull up, I'll pull up. Now, you know you I'll did. pull up, man. What's up? Holla at your boy, man. It's a unique hustle, man. Boss Talk 101, what a boss's talk. You did.